So this was already part two of our building session. As you can see today we mainly focused on this main aluminum tray where all the gears come in and our main rotor head. So this was quite a lot of work. It's not so much as yesterday when we built the half of the helicopter, but this was a really diff uh, really well let's say really important part and to take care of. Maybe you have seen uh, when you watch the building and the time lapse that for this cruise here I didn't use Loctite. This is because I have to get all that out again when I will mount the motor and I will have to screw one screw a bit better again. I don't have the tool here, I have to get it tomorrow so I will have to do that all out. Maybe later, so I will have to screw that again. So I didn't use Loctite, I just wanted to fit in. So, yeah, that's mainly it. And um, I know that in the manual it says that maybe you have seen it that normally we shouldn't have already, we should have already mounted the motor. I didn't do that. I have all these parts here sealed because I want to do a complete weight of the helicopter with blades, with canopy, with boom, but without any electronics because I'm interested in the pure weight of the mechanics. I didn't find that weight in the internet, so I just want to know that so I can calculate my 5 kilogram limit later on a bit better. So we will leave that out and yeah, in the, in the manual the next thing would be to mount the ESC, to mount the servos, all this stuff. As I told you, we won't do that. So tomorrow or, well, the day after, if I have time, I will mainly focus on the tail to do all the tail boom stuff, to have that ready. So at the end of the next building season, I hope that we will have the main helicopter ready. To, um, to know what's the weight of it. And then afterwards in the following seasons we can do the electronic stuff. So yeah, I'm quite glad with what I did today. I hope you like this building series and I would love to see you watching the next one again. Bye!